but this is where I want to have my lunch. So I got my, I'm just gonna get a taco. But they had like this like cantina chicken bullshit at Taco Bell. So I wanted to try it. But they put a bunch of weird sauces and shit in it. So I'm hoping, because I asked for no sauce, so I'm hoping that this is still good enough to eat. Which side is probably going to be better? chicken that's good I like that it's kind of a beautiful day and I wish I was at the beach but like most beautiful days I wake up far too late in order to take advantage of the beach mm. Yeah, that's pretty tasty. I don't know if it's seven bucks tasty. Chicken's okay. It's breast meat. So you might like that, you might hate it. It's a little dry. Which is probably why they put so much weird sauce on it. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, to kind of cover up the freezer burn or whatever, how they transport it. But honestly, if they didn't put all this like wet shit on it and just did the cabbage and onions and chicken and wrap that, it's probably be really fucking good. There's all the pico down at the bottom. That's awesome. So yeah, after I eat this, I think I'm gonna just sit here for a bit and get some sun. then go on about my day. This actually is kind of disgusting. Now that it's sitting in my stomach, I don't like it. Yeah, it's not very tasty. I could totally see this though, being like a like shit at a restaurant or the place my mom would go to she'd probably really like this mm -hmm. tortillas okay tortilla and the cabbage is good it just sucks because um there's all sorts of like street vendors, like selling different kinds of food and stuff. <clears throat> and I walked by like a ton of them and it was smelling so good. But there's two things. One, none of them take cash. So if I was to get anything from there, I would have to go to an ATM, pay an ATM fee, pull the money out and then go get it. That's a pain in the ass. <clears throat> I just need to start like, having cash on me the second thing is is that a lot of these places like just street vendors they put so much salt on everything it just like it's ridiculous it's not even like too much spice it's like dude why is there this much salt on this so anyway Sure. So, I'm just going to lay out for a bit.
going on? There's another guy way up there. But this dude here is circling. circling that building right there. I've never seen two helicopters if there wasn't like a pursuit or some kind of thing. So this is kind of crazy. Because I think that's a, another police or sheriff's helicopter. Saturday afternoon in LA. Okay, so check this out. So I just picked, I did not want monetization on this live stream for members. And the little box came up and it was like, are you sure? Don't you understand that what's gonna happen? And so I did the thing. So now I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna do members, live chat replay. Now watch, I'm gonna do members only and schedule this. 11 o'clock which is in 15 minutes members only scheduled for 11 o'clock done oh couldn't create the stream like why why would you be able to because that only happens when i'm doing a members only stream so let's try this again off wait look at this big blue box turning this off monetization removes what are you doing like stop boom boom members only 11 o'clock let's see they make it so fucking hard. And I honestly think it's just because I'm not running ads. Because when I do streams and I don't do that, it's fine. Okay, maybe this will work. I think this will work. I think. Okay, now look. Here's the thing. I had the thing set to members only at 11 o'clock. Okay, scheduled for 11 o'clock private. This has been set to private. Why was it set to private? So now when I go live, I'm going to be the only one watching this because I'm assuming that since I said it to members that, it, and maybe I just don't know how to fucking YouTube. I've been doing it for fucking eight years or whatever. Okay. So now we're going to go into edit and go to visibility. No members only. We already did this. And now, oh yeah, now we're gonna let your members know. Like, look, here, here you go. Why does YouTube do this?